There's a few things you can use a multimeter for around the house that would be useful. You have the continuity setting there to test fuses, including auto fuse. So if you have a problem with an auto fuse, you can test it the same way you'll test this little Christmas tree light fuse by putting leads on both sides of the fuse. If you get a beep or a light, then the fuse is good. If you want to check to see if the battery's good, you can set it to the little battery setting and it's checking the nine volts. If you get anything less than nine volts or even at zero, then your battery is bad. Batteries like AA, AAA, C, D, all are 1.5 volts. You set it to the 1.5, and as long as you have over 1.5 volts, then the battery is good. If you happen to have a resistor and you don't know how much resistance it has, you can set it to the ohms setting, as I'm doing here. If I don't know how to read the resistor, what I can do is set it to the resistor setting. Again, leads on each side, and in this case, I can see I have a 1K resistor to check to see if a circuit or a receptacle is good, you can put the insulated leads in the outlet. And here you have the voltage setting. Voltage AC is the V in a swirly line. And then if you see over 120 volts or around 120, then you're good. So hopefully that helped you out. And there's a link in the description for this multimeter or a similar one. I highly recommend getting it for these uses and others, which can be very handy. And subscribe for more tips. Thanks for watching.